Herman Raucher, the prolific storyteller behind iconic works like Summer of 42 and The Audacious Watermelon Man, passed away on December 28, 2023, at the age of 95 due to natural causes. Raucher's legacy in the entertainment industry spanned decades, leaving an indelible mark with his emotionally resonant narratives. Raucher's breakthrough came with the screenplay adaptation of his novel, Summer of 42, a poignant coming-of-age tale set amidst World War II. The 1971 film, starring Gary Grimes and Jennifer O'Neill, received widespread acclaim, earning four Academy Award nominations, including one for Best Original Screenplay, a testament to Raucher's storytelling prowess. His creative repertoire showcased remarkable versatility, in 1976, Raucher ventured into the Southern Gothic genre with Ode to Billy Joe, drawing inspiration from a popular song. Additionally, his contributions extended to scripts for films such as Sweet November, 1968, The Other Side of Midnight, 1977, and The Great Santini, 1979, demonstrating his ability to navigate diverse storytelling landscapes. However, one of Raucher's boldest endeavors was the 1970 film Watermelon Man, a satirical comedy delving fearlessly into themes of racial identity. Starring Godfrey Cambridge as a white man who wakes up to find himself black, the movie sparked discussion, earning both controversy and critical acclaim for its unflinching examination of societal prejudices. Raucher's storytelling prowess wasn't confined to the silver screen alone. His debut novel, the Summer of 42, not only became a bestseller, but also established him as a masterful storyteller adept at weaving compelling narratives across mediums. Amidst his legacy of groundbreaking stories, Raucher leaves behind a daughter, Jenny Raucher, as part of his surviving family. His passing marks the end of an era for storytelling, but his contributions to literature and cinema ensure that his legacy will endure, continuing to captivate audiences for generations to come.